One of the places I just love to visit are covered food markets. For example, there's the one in Madrid, pretty famous, and then there's the one in New York City as well. It's just the smells, the delicious food, it's just, ugh. Oh. Anyway, we got some good news for Amsterdam-based foodies as well. Yeah, you're right, Thomas. We are late adapters in Amsterdam, but we finally have one. And in our studio, we have one of the founders of the Food Holland. Welcome, Ching. Hi. Thank you. Ching, how's the business going? Crowded house? Uh, I don't think we have to complain. Uh, we are being a bit hyped, but yeah, people find us and they stay here as well. So things are going well so far. And Ching, is the Amsterdam Food Hall inspired by other food markets? Yeah, yeah mainly in Madrid. Uh, oh. Four years ago, uh, we had a drink and it was, as you said in the introduction, fantastic. So we decided to do this in Amsterdam as well. All right. Sounds like a great inspiration, but what makes the Amsterdam uh, covered food market so unique? Uh, first of all, the location itself. Uh, we are an old tram shed, tram depot. Has been empty for 16 years, um, but it just renovated uh, recently, and it's a monument. Uh, and also this, this, the stalls, the, the concepts, uh, mainly from Amsterdam. Sounds great, and uh, lots of different uh, companies are in the food market. Yeah, yeah, we got 21. Oh, uh, great. Oh. Okay, sounds great and sounds delicious. Uh, mm -hmm. I definitely drove by one time. Me as well. Yeah, you're welcome. <laughs> All right.